Now to the special legislative session underway in Tallahassee, where a bill would appropriate $10 million to voluntarily transport illegal aliens to and from anywhere in the United States made its way through its first committee today. The creation of the unauthorized alien transport program, it would fall under the Division of Emergency Management. It would facilitate the transport then of inspected unauthorized aliens within the U.S. Now, this bill was filed while the state its current migrant relocation program is facing a lawsuit to stop it from continuing. The suit says that the governor did not follow Florida law when he tra by transporting aliens outside of the state. This bill then would clearly state the transportation of unauthorized aliens would be allowed again in anywhere in the U.S. Still, the new wording wasn't enough for some lawmakers. What we're doing right now is carrying the water for the governor, knowing that what he did was wrong, and you all are holding your nose to vote for this and saying that is right. If the federal government was doing their job and controlling the border, we would not be here addressing this issue. We have fentanyl that is coming across our border. We have human trafficking that is coming across our border, and people tend to forget that when they're talking about this bill. The bill passed in its first committee. It is due up now for a second reading.